glass half full. Please welcome the professor and his man, Friday Pagey. <laughs> I just want to say at the top, I absolutely love the show Friday Night Boys, second yeah. year it was absolutely fantastic. Paige, you still got the uniform on? Yeah, well I'm a barman, I had to come straight from work. So. Oh, where do you work? Golden Touch Thai Massage. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, uh, Fletch, you left your loyalty card there. <laughs> <laughs> now, Professor, Professor, how does this segment work? Right, well, glass half empty, glass half full, uh, right? Uh, yeah. You know, life's full of ups and downs, swings and roundabouts, you know that better than anybody, Matty. Yes. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, so uh, it all depends on the way you look at it, your perspective, right? So tonight, uh, we're going to dissect the week's big stories while enjoying uh, alternative points of view. Okay, I've yeah. gotcha. Makes sense? Okay, it makes perfect right. sense. I'll leave this off. You ready? Yes. All right. During the off-season, Jared Mullen tested positive to a banned anabolic steroid. Mm. Uh, glass half empty. Um, he's now possibly facing a four-year ban from rugby league. Oh, Mr. Negative. Glass half full, boys. He's now joined the Russian Olympic team. <laughs> Negative. Professor, what are the symptoms of steroid abuse? Oh, thanks for bringing that up, Paige. Um, an, an enlarged head. Um, large hands. Uh, swelling. Uh, quick to be enraged. Um, <laughs> development of breasts. Um, <laughs> 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 oh, Wonder you should have tried them. You might have won a premiership. <laughs> In other news, Roosters recruit Luke Keary played down the house on Saturday night, helping himself to two tries in the Roosters' 32-18 win over the Gold Coast Titans. Uh, me again. Uh, glass half empty. His absence from his former club south didn't go unnoticed, with the Bunnies getting a hiding from the Tigers. You are a negative Nancy tonight. Glass half full. Despite Russell's disappointment, he got to take the quad bike out for another spin. <laughs> 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 now, uh, finally, as we've already seen, Bunny's fullback Greg Inglis injured his ACL less than 10 minutes into their claim against the Tigers. Despite the injury, the Bunny's coaching staff decided he should play on. Now, we've got some vision of him scoring a try here with the injury. <laughs> Glass half empty, again, due to the injury, Greg won't be able to play for the Bunnies all season. But glass half full, Greg won't be forced to play for the Bunnies all season. <laughs>